Today we are visiting a local garden to explore the main elements of an ecosystem. Let's look at one of the ecosystems we found within the garden. This ecosystem consists of biotic and abiotic elements. Biotic elements are the living elements such as the animals and the plants. Abiotic elements, which are also part of the ecosystem, are the non-living elements such as the water and the rock. The biotic elements of an ecosystem can be divided into two major groups, the autotrophs and the heterotrophs. The autotrophs are the organisms that can actually produce their own food. Plants are autotrophs. They use sunlight, water, and car carbon dioxide to produce their own food. Heterotrophs are those organisms that cannot produce their own food and feed on other organisms. In this example, we have a picture of a swan. The swan is a heterotroph that feeds off of other animals. This actually brings us to our next point, the relationship between two animals in an ecosystem. Let's look at this example. The frog is being eaten by the bird, which makes the frog a prey for the bird, which is the predator in this relationship. An ecosystem runs on relationships like this. Let's look at a more complex prey-predator relationship within an ecosystem. As you can see, a food web is displayed for you. A food web will always consist of the four major groups. We have the primary producers, they are all the way on the bottom. Then on the upper level we have the primary consumers. Above them are the secondary consumers and on the top level are the decomposers. Can you point out any elements of this ecosystem?